I was shy as a kid. The rules of conversation that other people seemed to innately understand just weren't obvious to me. But even after years of talking to people and getting pretty good at it, certain social rules still leave me completely at a loss. I found that we're not very honest with each other at all. In fact, we rarely say what we really mean. So I drew you some pictures to illustrate my point. What we say versus what we mean. What we say. Aw, she's gorgeous and looks exactly like you. What we mean. I see you're showing me yet another picture of your generic looking baby. What we say. Bye, thanks again for coming, have a great night. What we mean. Phew, they're gone. What we say. Trevor, it's nice to meet you, where are you from? What we mean. You're from Patterson, New Jersey. Your middle name is Kyle and your Venmo transactions indicate that you eat a surprising amount of Chipotle. Do you really think I'd go on this first date without obsessively researching you on every social media platform? What we say. Anything I can do to help? What we mean. Great, it looks like there's only one dish left to wash after this elaborate dinner party. What we say. Oh stop, you're the guest. You shouldn't be doing the dishes. What we mean. With every motion of this sponge, my resentment towards you builds. What we say. Because that's why. What we mean. I am realizing, having already opened my mouth, that I don't know how photosynthesis works. What we say. What we mean. Not that you asked, but something that sets me apart from most people is that I love airplanes. I've actually been looking forward to this flight for months. I strongly prefer a window seat. Sadly, not for lack of trying, I couldn't get a window seat today. You, the person sitting next to me, have lowered the window shade, ostensibly in order to sleep at 10.30 a.m., which means I won't get to see sunlight today, let alone the wonderful view of clouds that is the closest I personally have ever come to religion. What is wrong with you? Why can't you just cover your eyes with a sweater so we don't all have to suffer? What we say. Thank you so much for inviting me. I'll try to make it tonight. What we mean. I want to be as far away as humanly possible from the sadistic group ritual commonly referred to as karaoke. What we say. I'm just looking to have fun. What we mean. I am putting myself in all kinds of dangerous, time-consuming, emotionally draining, and deeply unpleasant situations in hopes of finding someone I'd like to spend my life with. What we say. Fine, thanks. What we mean. Inexplicably sad. The social rules that make sense to me are the ones that are useful. Rules like wait your turn, or wear clothes. I follow both of these rules all the time, and there are clear, positive results. But maybe that's why I get so stumped about the rules of when to tell the truth and when not to. Because maybe that's an aspect of life that isn't about rules at all. It's about feelings, which are much less predictable. It's probably best to sugarcoat with the stranger who asks how your day is going, even if you are inexplicably sad. But then again, what if this stranger is sad too and you miss an opportunity to connect? It's a tricky calibration, being honest about your own feelings while respecting the feelings of others. And with every interaction, we have to recalibrate. That's exhausting, but in some ways it's also kind. And maybe that's the way to be towards other people. Compassionate, which is to say, extremely tired and always wondering if you made a mistake.